In this video, we will be looking at 7 incredible foods to reduce your creatinine levels and increase your GFR, potentially helping you to put your kidney's health in the best condition. These incredible foods are very common to find and also affordable. You and I all have an amount of creatinine in our body. But having a high creatinine level is where the problem is. This tells that you have a problem with your kidneys. You might ask, what is creatinine? Creatinine are waste products that are produced by our muscles which are found in our blood. Our kidneys make sure that this waste product called creatinine is removed from our blood. So, when the kidneys are unable to function very well, the level of your creatinine in your blood will rise. The normal creatinine level is between 0.6 to 1.1 mg per deciliter in women and 0.8 to 1.3 mg per deciliter in men. To know your creatinine level, you have to perform the serum creatinine test. Again, if you want to know how properly your kidneys are working, then you can measure your GFR, also known as glomerular filtration rate. This is a calculation that compares your creatinine level alongside with your age, weight, gender, and race. A GFR that is 60 and above indicates that your kidneys are strong and healthy. If it's below 60 then it means you may have a kidney disease, and when it's 15 or below, then that may indicate that you have kidney failure. The food list you're about to see right now, all has the nutrients and minerals to help you improve your kidney's function. But before we go into the list, make sure to like this video, subscribe and let us know in the comment which of these foods you are already consuming. 7. Cucumber Through a variety of mechanisms, cucumbers may help lower creatinine levels. Their high water content aids in hydration, which is important for kidney function. Their low potassium content makes them suitable for people with kidney problems. Also, antioxidants, such as flavonoids and tannins found in cucumber, helps mitigate inflammation and oxidative stress, which benefits kidney health, and their mild diuretic properties increase urine production, which helps eliminate toxins, including excess creatinine. A balanced diet that includes 1 to 2 cucumbers per day can give hydration, antioxidants, and diuretic benefits. There are roughly 16 calories, 3.8 grams of carbs, 0.8 grams of protein, and very little fat in each medium cucumber, about 200 grams. Cucumbers are a refreshing and nutrient-dense alternative that can be readily added to salads, sandwiches, and other meals. You can also eat them as they are or infused in water. You can get this food in any grocery store, and it is very budget-friendly. 6. Sea Bass Like other fish, sea bass has a nutrient profile and health advantages that can lower creatinine levels and support kidney function. High-quality protein, which is abundant in sea bass and may help maintain healthy kidneys, is essential for bodily function and muscle repair. Furthermore, omega-3 fatty acids, which have anti-inflammatory qualities and may promote kidney function by lowering inflammation and oxidative stress, are abundant in sea base and low in saturated fat. These advantages can be obtained by eating sea base two to three times a week as part of a balanced diet. Sea base typically weighs 3 ounces, 85 grams, or about 100 calories, 20 grams of protein, and 2 grams of fat, including omega-3 fatty acids, per meal. Sea base can be cooked in a variety of ways, such as pan-seared, baked, or grilled, and it can be served with salads, healthful grains, and vegetables. Sea bass can be obtained in supermarkets' frozen food areas, or it can be bought fresh from fishmongers, seafood markets, and grocery stores. 5. Cauliflower Because of its nutritional composition and multiple health benefits, cauliflower may help decrease creatinine levels. Because cauliflower has low amounts of potassium and phosphorus, two minerals that can aggravate renal difficulties, it is a good choice for people who have kidney problems. Cauliflower also contains high levels of fiber, antioxidants, and vitamin C and K, all of which help kidney function and general health. These advantages can be obtained by eating 1 to 2 cups of cooked cauliflower each day as part of a balanced diet. About 28 calories, 5 grams of carbs, 2 grams of fiber, 2 grams of protein, and almost no fat are included in 1 cup, 180 grams, of cooked cauliflower. There are several ways to prepare cauliflower, such as roasting, mashing, steaming, or adding it to stir-fries and soups. 
All year round, supermarket stores produce departments usually have it readily available. 4. Cabbage. Cabbage is also high in nutritious properties and health benefits and can help lower creatinine levels. Cabbage is good for kidney health since it is also low in potassium and sodium and high in fiber, antioxidants, and vitamin C and K. It also helps with hydration, which promotes kidney function, thanks to its high water content. These advantages can also be obtained by eating 1 to 2 cups of cooked cabbage each day as part of a balanced diet. About 35 calories, 8 grams of carbs, 3 grams of fiber, 1 gram of protein, and fat-free are found in 1 cup, 150 grams, of boiled cabbage. There are several methods to use cabbage in cooking, fresh in salads, cooked in stir-fries, soups, and stews, or fermented to make sauerkraut. It grows well at home in gardens and can also be found at farmers' markets and grocery shops. 3. Garlic Garlic is frequently thought to help lower creatinine levels due to its nutritional qualities and other health advantages. Allicin, one of the chemicals found in garlic, has been demonstrated to have anti-inflammatory and antioxidant properties that may help maintain kidney health. Again, it might enhance circulation and lower blood pressure, both of which have an indirect positive impact on renal function. Although there isn't a set number of fresh garlic that is advised to lower creatinine levels, including one to two cloves of garlic in your diet on a regular basis might have some advantages. Garlic cloves have about 4 calories per clove, 1 gram of carbs, and trace amounts of protein, fiber, and vitamin C and B6. You may add flavor to a variety of recipes by adding garlic, such as soups, stews, stir-fries, sauces, and salad dressings. Fresh garlic cloves are available at farmers' markets and supermarket stores. Garlic supplements can also be found in capsules or tablets, but before taking any supplements, especially if you have any underlying medical concerns or are on medication, it is important to speak with a healthcare provider. 2. Eggplant Eggplant, also known as aubergine, is believed to potentially aid in reducing creatinine levels due to its nutritional content. Because high amounts of potassium and phosphorus can worsen a kidney disease, eggplant is a good food choice for those with kidney problems because of its low levels of these minerals. Furthermore, eggplant is high in fiber, phytonutrients, and antioxidants like naginin, which may promote kidney health by lowering oxidative stress and inflammation. Eating one or two portions of cooked eggplant every day may help lower your creatinine levels. 1. Onion Onions are often considered beneficial for kidney health and potentially helpful in reducing creatinine levels due to their nutritional profile and various health-promoting properties. Onions also contain substances called flavonoids, especially quercetin, which have anti-inflammatory and antioxidant properties that may help maintain kidney function by lowering inflammation and oxidative stress. Onions are also low in phosphate and potassium, which makes them a good choice for people with kidney problems. Consuming 1 to 2 servings of onions daily may have some advantages. About 44 calories, 10 grams of carbs, 2 grams of fiber, and trace levels of vitamin C and B6 are found in one medium onion or 110 grams. You can add it in your salads, soups, stews, stir-fries, and sandwiches. They are usually offered in several colors, including red, white, and yellow onions and the other foods which include berries, apples, and carrots. It's critical to approach dietary modifications as part of a comprehensive approach to kidney care. These foods can offer potential benefits for your kidney's health and possibly help reduce creatinine levels and increase your GFR. Furthermore, for individualized dietary advice, speaking with a medical practitioner or a trained dietitian is essential, particularly for those with kidney problems or high creatinine levels. A healthy lifestyle that incorporates regular exercise, sufficient hydration, and a well-balanced diet high in fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains can help people maintain optimal kidney health and possibly lower their risk of developing complications related to kidney dysfunction. So this is where we draw the curtains, and always remember that those who search for solutions will find answers. So keep learning! If you learned something from this video, kindly give us a thumbs up and most importantly, subscribe so you don't miss out on future health videos and share with your loved ones. 
Also, watch these videos that have popped up on your screen for further health knowledge. Thank you for watching and until next time, stay vibrant and stay healthy.